Hey, it's Jen again, and this is my dumpster dive video number 13. Uh, I just got off work. In case you're wondering what I do, I run my own little business here. Uh, me and my husband, we mow yards and do handyman work and that type stuff. So if you see me progressively get darker and darker through the next couple of videos, it's because I spend a lot of time outside. Um, so I found some pretty cool stuff throughout the week, and then I found some really awesome shit last night, and, um, I'm also gonna show you, like, um, they're not, like, thrift store pickups or, like, flea market pickups, but, uh, I have some eBay pickups that, like, I got the disc for, uh, you know, about 99 cents, complete, you know, booklet case and everything, and they're about two, three dollars shipping, so it's still, like, under four dollars for these games, which is pretty good, you know, but, um, I don't know, I'm really excited to show you what I found last night. I just, I couldn't fucking believe it. It's not a cons console, unfortunately, but it is still some good things. Um, so I found this Nintendo 3DS uh, Fantasy Life case right here. Comes with the booklet and everything. And here you go. Here's the code. You can use it. I do not have a uh, Nintendo shit. So there you go. You can have that. Um, what else? Let me get this sleeve, uh, case artwork back in here. Uh, Batman 2, DC Super Heroes, Lego, uh, Nintendo DS, and it should... Oh, there goes the booklet. Booklet's back there. No game. Another Kingdom Hearts booklet. No game. Another Chrono Trigger booklet. No game. This is pretty cool right here. I mean, it's not anything special, but I mean, it's Xbox One Grand Theft Auto 5. It's booklet and everything, just no disc, unfortunately, but it's a fairly fucking new, ain't it? Um, this little generic PS Vita case right here. I found this one last night. Another Kingdom Hearts. Um, the booklet's in the back back here. Hold on. Booklet, no game. <clears throat> the Legend of Zelda, uh, Phantom Hourglass. Booklet, no game. Too bad. Um, Golden Sun, Dark Dawn. Uh, pretty sure the booklet. Yeah, there it goes. Oh, fuck. So, there you go. Booklet, no game. Oh, here you go. Nintendo points. There you go. Take it. Thank me later. What else? Pokemon Diamond version. I don't think you can see it, but it's like glitterly, g glittery and shit. Let me see. Booklet, no game. Let me see if this has... Let me see if this has Nintendo codes. For you real quick. Real quick. Oh, it has a little collectible poster. Let's see what this looks like. Jeez. There you go. Look at that cool ass little collectible poster. I still have my Pokemon Crystal and Pokemon Red and Silver for my Game Boy Advance. Back in the day, what is that, like middle school for me, I think? Level 100 Charizard. Beat that shit. No Nintendo points. Found this nice DS case right here. Just It's extra thick. Put a lot of shit in it. Anyways, um... They don't really matter about these. They're just slaves. In case, you know, I need to complete a game. And they're actually pretty thick, too, so. Um, another Nintendo points. Here you go. Have that shit, too. Um, the little Tomb Raider. Uh, well, Xbox 360 expansion pack. Downloadable content only. No disc included. Why do they have a fucking case? Anyways. It's just the case. No booklet, no game. Downloadable content. Anyways. There you go. 
Uh, Xbox One game add-on download from Xbox Store, Deluxe Edition Dragon's Age Inquisition. So, I don't know if it's been used, but here you go. Can you see that code? Hopefully you can see it. I don't know why this... I don't know. If you can't see it, message me. I'll hold on to it, and I'll give it to you. Alright. I also found this. Monster Madness. Battle for Suburbia. Game. Uh, I think it's just a little scratched up, which I just need to probably buff out. I don't know if you can see it. It actually looks severely scratched up. But it's not like deep scratch. It's just all superficial. I just need to clean it up. And I don't know how this game is. I see it's by powered by Unreal Technology, which I loved Unreal Tournament as a kid. I used to play it all the time on my computer. But I don't know how this game is. I also found Halo 4 the other day. Right here, it works. And everything is actually really... A little scratches here and there. But it's it's... You know, it works, so that's fine. And then, you know, I ended up finding a case, and I printed off. I printed off the um, case artwork for it. If you go to www.thecoverproject, I think it's .net. Let me look it up real quick, because I'll also provide it in the description. Thecoverproject.net, yes. So it's .net, and you can find... A lot of stuff for uh, pretty much any type of console, any artwork that you need, just, you know, temporarily until you find the real artwork. I mean, that's what I do. I think it, I think it looks just fine. I mean, I'm sure you probably wouldn't even notice if I didn't tell you that this was actually printed out. Um, I also found this spray for the Wii. And uh, I'm actually going to give this to my brother since he has a Wii. And it's not... It's, uh... Just need to clean up a little bit, but it's actually in better shape. Now, if you do not know who my brother is, if anybody watches UFC, I'm pretty sure you'll know who this person is. My brother is Cole Miller. He fights in the UFC, and I'm pretty sure if you have either the Xbox 360 version or the PS3 version of UFC Undisputed 2010, he is in that game. So... That's why I, I talked to him the other day because I, I was doing his yard. And I asked him, I said, hey, you know, maybe I can do an interview on my YouTube channel. Or when I do one of my contests, maybe I can buy one of the copies of the UFC, und uh, UFC Undisputed 2010 and have him sign it and then mail it to the winner. So I think, I think that's a pretty good deal right there. Um, so I guess we'll see when we cross that bridge. Also, I also found... Um, this sleeve right here, which is awesome because I got this off eBay the other day, complete for 99 cents plus like two something dollars shipping. So now I have a sleeve for this case, which is awesome. And I also got this for about like 99 cents, two dollars shipping, 99 cents, two dollars shipping, 99 cents, two dollars shipping. So they're all complete. Um, I did have to print off the artwork for this one, but hey, you can't beat 99 cents and then like $2 shipping, that's not, that's not too bad. Anyways, I also, I found this little founders pack thing. I'm probably not going to keep it. I'm not really a fan or whatever, but I figured, you know, I'd show y'all. Uh, look forward to seeing this in the dumpster. Also, <clears throat> found this little Walking Dead display box right here. Probably give it to one of my friends who watches that. And this little, this little Pokemon thing right here. Uh, anyways, so I will go into the cool stuff that I found that I'm just like, oh shit, I can't believe I found that stuff. Right here. Let me move some of the stuff that I have right here to make room because oh my god all right all right oh I forgot this I found this like the other week I forgot to show you it's just another one of these this one this one actually did not come with the games like the last one did it's just a thing I found a bunch of steel books 
One of them is complete. Not all of them are complete, but look. Boom! This is uh, Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3 steel booklet right here. Boom. That. And the Devil May Cry 4 steel booklet. This one's beat up, but it has... Um, this is just the bonus DVD and the booklet. Boom. Uh, Metal Gear Rising Revengeance steel booklet. This comes with the soundtrack uh, disc. So, that's really cool. Call of Duty Black Ops 2 steel booklet. I mean, steel case. That which comes with this. Which I also found this. So this goes in this. There was nothing in this, but it's all yeah. I'll get to that one last. Modern Warfare 2 steel booklet. Uh, case. Fucking case. Booklet, no game. And uh, Call of Duty Black Ops steel case. Booklet, no game. So, those. Really fucking cool. Oh, this Halo 3. Steel booklet. It comes with both discs. The fuck? Ah! Let's not break it. Okay, disc one. Essentials. Awesome condition. And then you got... The only problem, it just won't fucking stay in there. Booklet. And we flip it around to the other side. And there it goes. Disc two. Boom. There you go. Nice. Really nice parts. Uh, anyways, I found uh was this Batman Arkham Asylum starring the Joker? Uh strategy guide. This one's pretty beat up, but still strategy guide nonetheless. Uh Prima official game guide, the Chronicles of Riddick, Assault on Dark Athena. Found this too. This is supposed to be brand new. Official game guide, Lord of the Rings Conquest. Found that. I'm actually surprised at this, because this is for fucking Game Boy Advance. The Legend of Zelda, the Minish Cap. Boom. And this is actually in really good condition. And this is old. This is old right here. And I'm keeping this, because it's awesome. Uh, official Brave Fencer, Musashi Strategy Guide. Boom. This too. Also, Studio Edition, Saints Row 3, Strategy Guide. Duke Nukem Forever, Strategy Guide. Boom. And Batman Arkham City, Strategy Guide. So, that concludes my video this week. And I found some really awesome shit, which I'm excited about. So hopefully everyone else is finding things too. I really want everybody to find some awesome shit because it's awesome. Share the love. Anyways, I'm always up for trades. For whatever the fuck you want, really. Uh, you can either buy things outright from me. Oh, well, not buy things. I mean, if you go to my eBay page, you'll have to buy it. But if you just want to pay for shipping, then I'll send it out to you. Whatever you want to do, up for trades, everything. Um, you can contact me on my Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and I'll give you that link to thecoverproject.net where you can, uh, print out some cover cases, well, case artwork, in case you, you know, you want to complete it and stuff like that, and, um, whatever. And, uh, <clears throat> contact me if you want those codes and you couldn't read them on the screen. Hopefully you could, maybe you couldn't, I don't know. I mean, fucking. Um, and anyways, that concludes this week of uh, dumpster diving. Good luck to everyone else and uh, peace out.